I'm Dr. Roger, and this question is from the April 2021 USSAT calculator section. College Board gives us a collection of scores for the first 10 games and then tells us the score in the 11th game, and they ask whether the mean or median, both or neither, increased when the 11th game has a score higher than any of the first 10 scores. So the 11th game we scored 18. And adding that to the, to the list, if we had only 10 scores, the first five, 0, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and the next five starts with 5, so halfway between the fifth and sixth score was 5. So our median the old median was 5, and the new median is also 5. The median did not increase, so choice C is wrong, and choice, no, choice B is wrong, and choice D is wrong. The median did not increase, so B and D are not correct. The question is, did the mean increase? We can calculate the mean, or we can go by our general knowledge. If you add a score to a list, and that score is larger than any of your other scores, your mean will always increase. So the mean did increase, and choice C is incorrect. The mean did not remain unchanged. Alternatively, we can calculate the mean, but this takes more time. If you add up the first 10 scores, and divide by 10, you get a mean of 4.3. for the old mean for the first 10 scores. If you take that total of 43 and add 18 more points and divide by 11, you get a new mean of 5.5. New mean is greater than the old mean. New median is equal to the old mean. So the mean increased in the The mean increased and the median remained unchanged. That's choice A. College Board often asks this question where the median does not change, but you add a score that's either larger than any other score or smaller than any other score. If you add an outlier that's larger or smaller than any of your other scores, the mean will always move in the direction of the outlier. And that's easy to remember and saves you time on computation. Come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.